Welcome back guys, my name is Chris. Um, I have a cool little project here today. These are my Sperry uh, top siders and I've had these for 15 years. I probably have not worn them in the past three years maybe, um, but I they still fit me um, and they are a little bit dry feeling. Um, so I'm gonna use some of this saddle soap on them. I'm also gonna use this Fibings, Fibings Golden Mink Oil on them. Uh, hopefully it'll bring them back to life a little bit. Um, however, I mean, these shoes are really good. They're, they've held up extremely well. I got them when I was 15 years old, I think, um, going to Europe. Uh, I got these before a Europe trip. I saved up some money and I was like, I need to get myself some pairs of shoes. So I was going on a cruise and I figured why not get some boat shoes. So I went ahead and got these Sperry Top Siders 15 years ago. So that is a testament to how these hold up. Um, I'm gonna do a little, a huge restoration. They don't really need a huge restoration, but I'm just gonna hit them with a little bit of this soap, saddle soap, and then hit them with a little bit of the mink oil and see what happens. Uh, I think it will help them come back to, you know, being a little less crispy, give them a little bit more life back in this leather. Um, so yeah, let's do it. Um, I also, actually, I also, before I get going, I have another pair of shoes that I so happen to put on today that I got at the same exact time. Uh, and this is a pair of Pumas. They're called the El Rays, I believe, but I, can, I cannot find them in brown anymore. Um, and I have worn these a couple of times I got these on the exact same day at the exact same Nordstrom's. Uh, so yeah, that's that. Uh, these are dirty, covered in hair. Uh, these are not. So um, these are really cool and I'll do a video on these too. But um, for now, we're sticking to the Sperry's. We're gonna get this done. Um, so let's go. All right, third try doing this. Uh, cats, cat ran away, cat jumps up on here, dog goes outside, dog comes in here. Third try doing this. Okay guys, we're back with the Sperry's. These shoes, I am super surprised at how good they turned out. Honestly, they are, uh, they cleaned up really, really well. Um, it's been a day or two since I did the conditioning of these shoes. And they look nice. Um, I, I could have put a little bit more uh, mink oil on them, but I, I wanted to let it soak in and then see exactly what it looked like uh, with one coat on it, and I think that's enough. Um, it shows a little bit of scuff marks, a little bit of wear, but I think that's, they're 15 years old, you know, and I think it's actually a part of the shoe. It's almost like a salvage denim pair of jeans. Uh, you want, you don't really want to wash them in soap and water. You want to just kind of let them do their thing, wear them, let them get their marks, and um, they form to your, your body, just like these form to your foot. And these are 15 years old, and when I put them back on, I was pleasantly surprised at how well they fit to my foot, how good they felt. Um, it's funny because I'm probably gonna go put these on and run around with my dog outside right now. Um, but they are great. Uh, and I will say one piece of fashion advice that I will give you with these Sperry's, um, specifically, well, I guess this is for anybody, uh, men or women who wear their Sperry's, do not wear them with socks. Uh, it, it's, a, it's not a good look. They're not meant to be worn with socks. 
They're meant to be worn without. Uh, I have worn, again, these are 15 years old. I have worn them like crazy, probably not in the last three years, but they don't smell at all. I have, I have shoes that I wear with socks um, that smell, these don't smell at all. I have shoes that smell and I wear them with socks. Um, of course, I have my Tevas on with my socks, but that is something you do not do in your Sperry's. Guys, gals, do not wear socks in your Sperry's, please. Um, that is not the right look. And if you're going to wear pants with your Sperry's, roll them up so you have like a quarter cuff um, or ideally wear them with shorts. But anyways, I'm super happy with how they turned out. I would suggest going to get a pair yourself. Uh, if they would last you 15 years like mine did, it's a good investment. Um, Sperry's, classic, always good. And uh, yeah, so uh, that's all I have for today. I hope you liked the video. Um, I wanna thank all my subscribers. I have 110 now, I gained another one, which is fantastic. And they say once you have 110 followers, you're easily on your way to 5 million. So that should be no problem at all. Uh, <laughs> that's what we're going for. I don't know, I'm just playing. But yes, thank you guys so much. I appreciate all of you. Uh, if you like this video, click like, click subscribe, do that whole thing. And I will see you guys on the next one. Thank you very much. Thank you.